guys, it's Fabi. Today's Korean drama review is gonna be on Ruler, Master of the Mask. It's also known as Emperor, Owner of the Mask. This is a 40 episode historical, political, romance drama. Each episode is 35 minutes long, so actually it is all the just 20 one hour long episode. This drama takes place in the 1700s and it is about the crown prince going up against this group and I do not know how to pronounce the group's name so I'm just not gonna bother. Um, and they've accumulated a lot of wealth and power through privatizing the water all around the country and because of this people are suffering so the prince kind of becomes a hope for the people. And it's also about him falling in love with this woman who ends up helping him become a better ruler. This organization actually kind of controls the king and the king actually isn't really much of a king. He's just figurehead, a puppet king if you will. The king, to prevent his son from being part of this group, he puts a mask on his face so that no one knows his face because to join this organization, the organization has to know your name and what you look like. Also to try to stop this group, they, a king has found guys that have the same name as his son to switch him like, like you know, as a double, you know, so that if anything goes wrong and they try to take the crown prince, it's not really the crown prince, it's someone else. So because of an event that happens that I'm not gonna tell you about because that would be big spoilers. The crown prince ends up having to get his place switched and when that happens he ends up not being able to come back to the palace so he ends up living outside the palace and someone takes his place and that become that person becomes a puppet king as well. He wants to take on this group but he doesn't have any power so a professor of his tells him to basically just start from the bottom and he gains power throughout the country on his own and basically he's just trying to build power to take on this group because the people are suffering i really enjoy this drama it's nicely done i'm not a big fan of historical drama the romance is there here and there. I think it's cute because it's very innocent right now. Do I recommend this drama? If you're looking for historical political drama, yes. Even if you're not looking for historical drama, but you're looking for political drama, I would recommend this. Again, if you're looking for something that's on a happier note, then no, this isn't the happiest drama because it is about people suffering and people trying to find ways to go up against this group that has all the power and a lot of people aren't going to be winning. A lot of people are going to be dying. A lot of people are being sacrificed for the greater good, but I really haven't seen a very political drama in a while, so it's getting me going. It's making me very excited. There is another drama that's airing currently at the same time as this, at the same like time slot, and I will say I enjoy this drama better than that one. Remember to like, comment, subscribe for more Korean drama reviews, and have a nice day.